Almost there. Hang Chow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know. What do you want from me? We're Mongols. We're supposed to build a huge m military. Oops. No, no, no. Not you. Did I wake you up? Okay, good. Russia! You're gonna be in trouble! We're coming for you! Where am I? Aha! Oh, Russia, you are in trouble. Yes, I know. Wow, they're really eliminating units, aren't they? It says build the barracks. Change to knights, I guess. Oh! Oops! I didn't mean to do that. But, I did it. <laughs> Entry. Disband. Disband. Oh, I didn't mean to do that either. Okay, let me take that frigate around and see what the Russian's island is looking like. They might only have Moscow, I don't know. Damascus. Bukhara builds diplomat. They must have another city up there. I mean, otherwise, why would they have that ir irrigation? But they're really horrible civilization. Usually the Russians are pretty tough. I don't know what's going on. Maybe their starting place just sucked. Oh boy. Okay, there we go. Got a phalanx in London. Let's build a barracks. Even though... Probably not going to do anything out of London. I know! Stop saying that! No! Hey! Whoever, go! Get Moscow, now! Yay! Bye bye, granary. Ah, I knew that wouldn't be it. Let me just check out that island there. Ah. You know what, let me get that guy. Sentry. Okay. Ah, there's a city. Is that Leningrad? 
No, it's Smolensk. How many cities do they have? Like a big continent right there. Do the Russians own that? And just take out another one of these guys here. Huh. Okay. Russia doesn't look like it's going to be too hard to take over. Although it could be wrong. I don't know. Build a frigate there. Why not? Eh, <laughs> eh. <laughs> okay, let's unload these guys. Except for you. Let's unload these guys. Unload these guys. Unload this guy. And then, boom! <laughs> there we go. Uh, I'll just sentry that guy in there. Making sure my cities aren't undefended. You know what, I don't need this settler. Ha <laughs> ha. Ha ha. Don't. Let's unload these guys here. Why not? Oh, come on. There's another city. Whoa. Chariots. Okay, let's go get some more units here. This might be a little bit longer than I thought it would be. And turn. Dang, 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 dang. Kiev. I'll take over Minsk with my diplomat, I guess. Might as well. Unload these guys here. Although I don't think there's anything there. Haven't found Leningrad, but maybe it was destroyed. Oh, here we go, another ship. Perfect. 
Oh, wait, wait, wait. There we go. Uh, yeah, I don't really need that guy there. Wait, let me see... Intelligence Advisor. Yeah, just the Russians. Just Stalin. Oh no! Settler's in my way. Pay. Inside a revolt. Oh, it's not giving me any units. Uh oh. Well, it shouldn't be in civil disorder now. Oh, come on! Is Kiev their last city now? Looks like it probably is. Okay, better be, because it's being a pain in the royal butthole. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kunaksa build settlers. Sire, we can't afford that many military units. Shut up and do as I say. I'm Genghis Khan. I will eat you for breakfast. Uh, so far away from that stupid city. Where is it? Minsk. Just get back, dude. Yay! Almost done, I think. They can't have another city. It's not possible. Disband. Disband. Kunaksa. Ooh. Just build. Five, three. I'm only expanding the non like Roman Greek one. Okay, that better be it. <laughs> Yay, we're done. Uh, my palace is going to be asymmetrical. Fine. Fine, I'll do the middle. My poor cave. My poor cave. That's a... That's kind of a cool looking palace, I guess. Yay! We won. We love king. Latest poll results. You better love me. Ah, uh, Hammurabi. Our tiny little island wasn't big enough for the both of us. Ah, uh, Montezuma. Put a shirt on. Eh, 
Haha, <laughs> Napoleon. Napoleon's so short, you can see his feet in that portrait. <laughs> I like the Zulu music in IBM sounds, too. It's pretty cool. I think the Chinese song's pretty different, too. The Mongols is very, very different. Bleh. Yay. Okay, so yeah, that strategy that I did only really works in V1 or 2, I think. I'll show you what happens if you try this in one of the later versions of Civ, Civ 1, because I already did that. and it doesn't go very well. Yay. We were actually pretty close to the English for a while before we started conquering everybody. Complete replay. Oh yeah, because we started with two settlers. That was kind of an advantage. But you don't always have to start with two. Wow, that's kind of a weird setup for the Chinese there. How do, how do they even get a settler out that fast and then go all the way up there? They were cheating, I swear. Those cheating, cheating cheaters. How did Leningrad get destroyed? There's no way anybody could have gone over there by ship. Like, see, Mongols produced first trireme. Maybe, I guess maybe barbarians? I don't know. Then I lost that city. Stupid Ormuz. Yay. Bye bye, Babylon. Oh, that's right. The, Zimba the Zulus were founded after the Babylonians got, got killed. Totally forgot that. And then. Wow, like, everybody's pretty much conquered their continent, except for the Russians. Don't know what happened to them. And pretty much everybody had their own continent. That's kind of weird. Then the Russians start fighting back, I guess, but... That city in China gets destroyed sooner or later. Yeah, the English did have a city there. Did the Zulus kill it or something? I didn't destroy Exeter. Maybe it was the Zulus. And I don't know why the English didn't take Orleans. It's kind of weird. And bye-bye England. And then bye-bye Russia. Yay! 980. 920 80. Should get a pretty good score here. 1608, wow. Yeah, because I finished pretty early, that's why. 160%! Woo! Exceeds even Solomon the Wise. Who's this Ray Maloney jerk? Alright, so... Let me see if I can... Uh... Wait, just give me a second, I'll show you what happens when you try to do this on one of the later versions. Okay, so, right now I'm running in version 4, right up here, 47404. So, one... Yeah, let's go IBM sounds again, why not? Let's see, I should have a Genghis Khan here. Yeah. 
240 BC. So this is like the same sort of strategy, but it really doesn't work here because look at the look at all of this like it's all just civil disorder everywhere. And if I show you like see we have these super unhappy people that were added in this version and so like see like by default there are zero happy people born two very very unhappy people and one unhappy person Let's see do i have any cities that i just built yeah like here i even have a guy in the garrison here but this guy's still unhappy <laughs> I guess if I got rid of the garrison guy, he would be unhappy still. So yeah, I have all these cities, and like I should be able to go and just destroy everybody, but I can't produce anything because everybody's in civil disorder. It's ridiculous. Like, Samarkand's not, but that's because I've, like, I don't know. I guess the capital's not as affected. But I don't know. I'm like, I have three units in all these cities, and it just, it doesn't matter. Like, Bokara, I have three units, and it doesn't matter. Still super unhappy people. Do they, I don't know if they look different than just regular unhappy people. Some weird guy with a sword. I think that's what regular unhappy people look like. Yeah. Alright, but anyway, that is it for this. So, yeah, it's make sure if you want to try doing what the Mongols do, you play on, like, version 1 or 2. Yeah, because... <laughs> this is just, like... I don't know, it's too hard, like... Like, the strategy would be to wait for your cities to grow and then remove a resource like that, you know, and then you can proceed, but then it still doesn't really work that well because you're either in civil disorder or you're not growing. <laughs> all right, but anyways, that's all. So I will see you in another Civilization game. Bye.